In this lesson, we will implement the rest of the script to generate the fake data. So first, let's clean this up. And I'm going to import faker. And import bcrypt. And I want everything to run in a transaction, so I'm going to do a client.query begin. And let's clear this out. And I'll add a try catch statement here. And at the end of this, I'll run a commit. And if there is an error, I'll run a rollback. And in either case, I will want to run um, or client.end that. And then here uh, we can log or log the error. And I believe this needs to be an await, so like that. Okay, so we can start implementing the script. So I'll define salt rounds, generate a hash. So one two three one two three is going to, going to be our password. So I'm adding on conflict do nothing in case we want to run the script more than once, uh, because if we're trying to insert multiple demo users, that might result in an error. So I'll add the parameters here. So the name will be demo and the password will be the hash we just created. And then, okay, so after we create the demo user, let's uh, select that user. So get the first row from that response. Okay, so let's create some notes for this uh, demo user. So I'm going to create a loop here. And let's log out some stuff here. So creating note for demo user. Wait, client.query. in here so demo user dot ID will be the user ID and then this is where we'll start using faker so faker dot lorem dot sentence faker dot lorem dot paragraphs and let me look that look that okay and 
let's uh, create some users, some additional users as well. So I'll create another loop here. log out some text here okay so I'll run a query generate a random username for the user and also pass in a hash so that we can log in as that user uh, using the same password. Now once we have created these users uh, we we'll want to select the users that we just created and then generate some notes for those users. So I'm going to run a select statement here. And for each of these users, I'm going to generate 10 nodes. So to do that, I can do a for row of users res.rows for let i equals 0, i less than 10, i plus plus. out creating note i for user row.id and I'll run a query So we'll pass the row.id as the user ID, and we'll use faker to generate sentence and faker to generate the paragraphs. Okay. Uh, and then we run the commit, and if there's an error, we'll do a rollback, log out the error, and at the end, we disconnect from the client or disconnect from the database and all right so I think this script looks okay I'm gonna save it and uh, I'm gonna go to the terminal and I'm gonna run npm run seed all right so uh, looks like it logged out uh, some output here so let's go to table plus and go to our users table go to data and I'll hit control R to refresh that and you can see that it has generated uh, some users and then if I go to notes and data um, you can see that it has generated a whole bunch of uh, notes for the users.